We actually chose the Lone Survivor Foundation as a charity that would uh, benefit combat veterans and their families because most of the money that they, they're at a high percentage of the money that they raise actually goes to the project and the families and the, and the combat veterans. Honestly, I came up with the concept uh, in a coffee shop where I saw a guy with a t-shirt that uh, had a, was kind of a lift-a-thon for another organization. Started talking to him about it and uh, it just occurred to me what a great opportunity to match two great things and that's uh, Hokie Strength and Conditioning Football and Hokie Athletics and um, Lone Survivors Foundation. What we decided to do is to see if we could get a pledge per pound for uh, on the bench press. We chose the bench because that's the lift that most people can identify with. Everybody has done it. and. Uh, if we could get a per pound lift on our max session, which we were going to do anyway, and these kids are more excited about it. Uh, it it's been greatly received, more than I ever expected. And uh, we put on the internet or put on the website uh, what their previous max was, what their first max was here at Tech, so people would have an idea about how much they were pledging. And it, again, it's really exceeded my expectations. I honestly was hopeful that we might get 10,000, and it looks like we're going to be close to 35,000. So, as, you know, most of these guys, another uh, positive about the Lone Survivor Foundation versus some of the others is the, uh, that these kids know about uh, um, Marcus Luttrell and they've seen the movie, a lot of them have read the book. A lot of our guys are connected to the military in different ways, their parents or relatives, so they very much had a passion for it. I just want to really uh, thank everybody that uh, took the time to pledge these kids. Everybody on the team had a pledge. Um, that's awesome. And, you know, I'm overwhelmed really by how the Hokie Nation has stepped up to help this uh, um, fundraiser that we did. Not a penny of it's going to us uh, and all of it's going to combat veterans and, and their families and I really appreciate it uh, uh, more than you know. And I appreciate all you guys stepping up.